Oh, what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have uh, rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary, but the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing around the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. Over. Salas. Just brushed off the ball there. And the counter is on. forward he is not one readily to admit defeat don't be surprised if he tries that again he's left his man it's a very good battle there terrific to watch And it's played forward, cuts it out, and now they can launch a counter. And the ball's come at another time! Pez United have created a real intensity from the start, and there's no sign of any let-up. Aquilani. Whipped in. Here comes another cross. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Tries to get it forward quickly. Lobs it in gently. behind for a corner kick gets up to hit it decent attempt but not quite good enough Over. 
loses his balance and loses the ball. And shoots! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back page headlines there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Back to the keeper and go again. Ball has crossed the line and it's a throw. The referee's awarded a free kick. Been leave it clear. Salas. There's a lot of movement up front. Yeah, I have noticed that those uh, front players are working very hard, dropping deeper. Yeah, and I just think it keeps the opposition off guard with, with so much switching of position. Keeping shape is, is much harder. Hurls himself at it! Brave effort, total commitment. A good attempt. The ball was at a, a lovely height too. That's gone a long way up and away. Far from making something happen by himself, lovely to see. Gets away from his opponent. Ball's loose, who's getting there? That's a chance to shoot! It's in! Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Forward it goes. Has ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Alia. out on the left now hardly anything between the sides and it's 1-0 Bovo Salas out for a throw long looking for space out wide it'll be a throw in turns and goes back 
defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. That has sent him sprawling. He's been taken down and the referee has pointed at the spot. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? A formality. We're level. A time for a cool head, and that is precisely what he showed. Oh, you could always see he was confident about that. He always looked like he was going to score. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Here it comes. Good try cutting inside here. Massively! header but really it was all about the delivery well as contact goes that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net i think when it comes to the aerial department this fella is definitely no slouch Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Hoists it forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Oh, good interception. So a really good half of football, three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Very little in it. The score at half-time is two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. Hit long and direct. In comes the cross. Can he shoot? Goes for it! Just took too long getting forward. Look, if they're going to counter, it has to be pacier and much more decisive. And it's been taken short. Dmitry Komarov. Bovo. Dmitry Komarov.
And here's the chance to counter. Out to the left it goes. Yep, it's a corner. They've played it short. A oh, really good feat. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Big chance! That's a half decent try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Dmitry Komarov tries to get it forward quickly. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. Gets it back. Pinged one through here. Gets the pillar of his man. Away from immediate danger. Salas. Bovo. Dmitry Kombarov. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, he just had too many touches, and he was asking for it to be pinched off him. The better of his opposite number. Well positioned to make that interception. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that has been clubbed away. That looks a good ball. Yeah, he's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Hoists it forward. Gets wrestled off the ball. But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Gets the chance to cross. Breaks on here. He's got options out wide. Nicely controlled. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Hoists it high. Looks to play him in. That's uh, a minor communications breakdown. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And 
Hops available out wide. They get a throw in. Played in. Up to meet it! Oh, taken with style! A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. Absolute gem of a cross. It made the header simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. So the lead now is two. Gets it upfield. Battles to win it back. Out to the right. Forward it goes. Amera. Real chance to break. He's through. Aquilani. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Oh, that's over hit. Two minutes to be added on. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Alia tries to get it forward quickly. And the referee brings it to a close. This win by a very competent performance. Without doubt they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. You look back on the game then, Jim. Well, they approached this with a very definite game plan, and I think to a large extent they remain true to that. And we can give the manager a, a big pat on the back. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.